Hi, my name is Segi Munin, and I'm a PhD student at the Technion. And today I'll present to you a work of single pixel imaging of dynamic objects. In single pixel imaging, a single detector is used to capture an entire scene. This is achieved by illuminating the scene with different spatial patterns and collecting the reflected light with the detector. However, in case of motion, the reconstructed images suffer from both blur and motion artifacts. In our work, we propose algorithms to improve the reconstruction of dynamic objects. We divide our algorithms to two, one that handles global motion of the entire scene and another that handles local motion of only parts of the scene. In our global motion estimator, we use our measurements from multiple frames to reconstruct pairs of images from some samples of adjacent frames. We then use cross correlations between the reconstructed pairs to estimate the motion in both axes. Once the motion is estimated, we incorporate the motion in an optimization problem and recover our final image. For a local motion estimator, we use our measurements to reconstruct an initial upsampled noisy series of images. Using these images, we estimate the foreground pixels where the motion occurs. We then use the estimated foreground and our measurements to individually reconstruct the background and the foreground. Once we have both reconstructions, we combine them to, for our final series of images. In this slide, you can see some results from our global motion estimator. In the first row, we present a simulation of how motion affects reconstruction of a complex scene, and how our algorithm improves the quality of the reconstruction. In the second row, you can see an experimental results of a resolution target which was moved during imaging. And you can see how our reconstruction algorithm both improves the final quality of the image and the resolution of the image. In this slide, you can see some results of our local motion estimator. In the first row, you can see a simulation constructed out of two static airplanes and one dynamic airplane that moves during imaging. And you can see how our local motion estimator is able to remove the artifacts from the background and recover motion blur. In the second row, you can see an experimental result constructed out of a static part of the image and a dynamic part of the image. And you can see how our algorithm is able to recover the dynamic part of the image, although it disappears completely in the standard reconstruction. We hope you enjoyed our work and thank you for listening.